Okay, we're here backstage. You're backstage with our residents for this week and we're really excited about this project and uh, here to tell us about it. We're going to let Una do some talking here. Una, it's absolutely brilliant to have you all here um, with us. Um, would you like to tell us a little bit about the project that you're working on? Yeah, sure. So firstly, thank you so much for having us. It's such a pleasure. Um, first time out of the house in the pandemic to come up to Longford and we've been really, really taken care of. Um, it's so great to be back in the theatre working as a team of writers here and um, we're working on a project called Blue in the Wild. So what's interesting about it is that it's, it's, a, it's actually a film project, but um, it's about uh, two female theatre artists coming together. They're sort of emerging actors putting on a play together. So there's sort of a play within the play. So it was really meaningful to develop this in a theatre and to be in context. And today's our second day. Um, and yeah, we've been working really hard. We've got a wall full of post-it notes, brainstorming ideas, researching together. So it's so much more fun to be doing it as a group and have, you know, five brains on, on, on the problem solving and the thinking together. Fantastic. And I think with it being a play almost within a movie, it gives it gives so many more dimensions to it, so many more angles that you can approach the subject matter with. Um, so I think the really exciting thing about this project is that we're, we're sort of trying to break out of some sort of storytelling conventions in some sort of way and, and sort of shine a, a new light on the subject matter. Uh, and I think Una's really curated this sort of amazing schedule and weekend with the support of Backstage that sort of allows us to really think outside the box and bring these storylines together that gives an audience a fresh perspective. And I think those spaces in an Irish film industry are really important. I think they're really important for writers, emerging writers who are on the track to develop their careers. And like having that space after months of being on Zoom calls to actually be in a room together and talk about the subjects that we're passionate about is something so valuable to us. Brilliant. And I mean, you've, you've travelled from all over Ireland to be here, but obviously we have a familiar face for Longford here, Felicia. It's brilliant to have you all here. Um, how does it feel just being in this space and being able to come together and Felicia to, to come home? <laughs> Oh gosh, um, it feels amazing um, walking in and being like, oh, there's Felicia. And like, oh yeah, yeah, it is me from here. Uh, it's really nice to be home and to, to be creating as an adult at home. Um, it feels slightly different, so I'm kind of getting used to it. I'm like um, flexing into that space, you know, it's nice. Brilliant. And we're going to we're gonna bring some of the, like we have sort of just sort of, guideline scenes mm -hmm. and of course all the nuance and tricksy and beats and emotional moments in those scenes we haven't ironed out in the time we've had but what we're going to do is bring it to life mm -hmm. and um that's yeah. that's there's in this group there's some really great actors as well i'm not one of them <laughs> but but I'll, I'll i'll enjoy uh giving feedback on that so yeah. even though we're not on stage stage we're kind of yeah we're doing a bit of theater yeah. as well later and it's probably uh, worth mentioning what your guys' backgrounds is yeah. as well for people who don't know. Chiamaka, if you want to um, My name is Chiamaka Eniamadi. I am a writer, editor, arts facilitator and performer. Um, and yeah, that's like my background mm -hmm. is really in poetry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I'm advancing into prose and now into screenwriting. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's, a, it's very interesting um, and yeah, inspiring journey. Uh, my name is Derek Kukuchuku. I am an actor, screenwriter. So having the opportunity to work with great minds during this time is amazing. So we're having a blast. It's brilliant. it's brilliant to see so many different genres all working together. And I think over lockdown, it's probably just all this creativity bubbling away. So to be able to get together and I'd say the energy levels are high. Yeah, it's been amazing actually how how well it's worked because yeah. in some ways like it's a it, we're kind of pioneering this like there is an experimental nature mm -hmm. to it it's not usual to have like a writing workshop with this many people in film it is maybe in tv it's not a feature film, not a feature yeah. film. Mm -hmm. and it's like yeah it's 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 an experiment that's really paying off mm -hmm. and like hopefully we might get the chance to develop it again who knows maybe you can come back to, to Lancaster again oh, so. we'd love to have you <laughs> that's where we're so <laughs> delighted with our <laughs> that these activate residencies give artists like yourselves the opportunity to create and I think now more so than ever that they're just really necessary and 
hopefully really helpful. Yeah, no, you really progress the work so much more meaningfully and yeah. quicker yeah. in this context. And like, I know that we all know that, but actually when you've been away from these kind of contexts for a while, it's just, it's so abundantly clear that like, yeah, we're born to collaborate in this way and we work much faster and more effectively. And I think our better problem solvers in a group as well, because, you know, three of the four or four of the five might be going, yeah, 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 let's move ahead. And the other person going, no, I'm not sure. And it's OK, we haven't got a green light yet. So we go into that problem and we tease it out and we discover something about the character that's really important. So I think that's been really just pleasurable for me to recognize the strength of the group and and sort of you know it's not always about being on the same page it's actually about going hang on a second let's go back to that mm-hmm. and and it's kind of like archaeology you're kind of digging mm-hmm. together and discovering new things as you as you go ahead mm-hmm. i love that reference <laughs> <laughs> listen we are so excited we're delighted to have you here first of all and just so excited to follow your journey and um, i'm sure our audience will be excited to follow your journey as well and see what's what's to come Thanks Thanks so much for taking the time to talk to us. Thank you. Thank you.